We have a brilliant script, a really a very special. Major. It's uh, a, a vehicle, a comeback vehicle for Diana Ross. A Billy Ray Cyrus. It's yes. kind of a star is born. So, your first screenplay sold for half a million. Mm -hmm. Should have been two. Yeah, except our lawyer, son of a bitch, caved in on us. Well, that won't happen again. No, see, we're going to get a lawyer that's tough, a lawyer that's savvy. Can someone to step on his grandmother for us. <gasps> <gasps> Mr. Green, uh, David Murphy would like to speak to you. He says it's urgent. Ooh, uh, put him on the speaker. This is an old college buddy. Might only take a second. Jeremy? Davey, I'm in the middle of a meeting. What's up? Well, listen, um, we need you to close a deal. Ooh, what kind of deal? A big deal, very big deal. Ooh, big deal. Go on. We're in, in, in Vegas at the Hilton. Uh, we met John Gage. You know who he is? Sure I know who he is. He's a billionaire and a, uh, a major poon hound. He is? Mm-hmm. Go on. He offered us... Uh, Million dollars. Million dollars? For what? Your kidneys? For one night with Diane. What do you mean? One night? Like... Yes. Could you excuse me for a second? Uh, let me get this straight. Um... He offered you a million dollars for a night with your wife? As in your wife, Diana? And you agreed to it? I don't know what to say. I mean, how could you do something like that? How could you negotiate without me? Never negotiate without your lawyer. Never! For a woman like Diana, could have gotten you at least two million. Obviously, you don't want to get screwed and then screwed. Hey. Stay, please. This is damage control. Two no. seconds. Go, eat, eat cookies. No, this no, cookie's you, coming. You don't understand. We've heard enough. You're hired. You are. You're our Thanks. man. We love your style. Oh, great. Thank you. Gladys, check the gentleman's schedules. Call me next week. Wednesday? Wednesday good? Great. See you then. Okay. Thanks for coming. No, thank you. Thank no, you. thank you. Thank you. Um, okay, David, before we go any further, let's, um, let's get the moral issue out of the way. Don't leave that to us. No, I was referring to my fee. I, I get 5%. Do you want to elaborate on the verification clause? Verification. Um, that means you pay even if the relationship isn't consummated. You mean if I'm impotent? It's important for a lawyer to cover contingencies. I can live with that. The John Garfield clause? Uh, that's if you die in the act. I have no problem with that either. Can I have your pen? Pretty good, you know. Well, thank you. You should come work for me. Ooh. But you know, cheer up. You gotta find a more creative way to think about this, okay? Just look at it like an episode of the dating game that went a little bit, you know, awry or something like that. It's good. Ladies you know, and you know, gentlemen, like no we idea. wish to welcome you to our jamboree. Over he went. I couldn't believe it. I know we could have gotten two million. Here's your Buddha. Davey, no point getting out the crying towel. You got a million bucks, buddy. A million Take bucks. The from She's an amazing woman. She really is. Couldn't have gotten 500 from my girlfriend. Not that I'd do that. But it's okay that you did. This is a different situation, and she agreed to it. You gotta remember that. And it's not like it's hard duty or anything like that. Ellie's a great looking guy. A million bucks, I'd sleep with him. <laughs> Maybe not. I knew something like this was gonna happen. I guess you, uh, you make a deal with the devil. And eventually you pay the price, right? Thanks, Jeremy. Coming from the man who closed the deal with the devil, that's very comforting. Green. Oh, hi, Di. I'm not here. Yeah, he's right here. You want to speak to him? No, I don't want to talk to him. Look, sweetie. He loves you. You love him. I mean, you gotta try and work this out. It's all pretty simple, right? This is the deal even 
and I can't screw up. Tell him you can keep the money. I don't want any of it. Davey? She says she doesn't want the money. Well, I don't want the money either. I'll take it. I mean, nobody else wants it. 